When I speak with a family about Columbus Academy to give them a bit of context before a tour, I often talk about the six pillars of the school. I entered fourth grade at Academy in 1971, so I've been around a while. I've seen the school evolve over that time, so I speak of these pillars in chronological order. The first pillar is unparalleled academics. Since 1911, Academy has done a wonderful job of preparing students for college and beyond. Our average graduate has taken four advanced placement exams with an average score of four. Our curriculum is advanced and the teachers are adept at differentiated instruction, so we challenge students in healthy ways. Our students enjoy learning and appreciate their faculty as mentors and advisors. Our middle schoolers say how well prepared they are to be upper schoolers, and then, after matriculating to college, our graduates routinely report their preparation for college was terrific. The next pillar is athletics. Of course, participating in sports is not required, but the philosophy of healthy mind and healthy body has been an important part of the academy since its founding. We have a tradition of strong athletics here. Interscholastic sports begin in sixth grade and about 80% of our students participate in at least one sport each year. Beyond being fun, being on a team reinforces the value of collaboration, communication, hard work, and delayed gratification, all important 21st century soft skills that students need to be successful. The third pillar is the arts. Both fine and performing arts are vibrant and key pieces of an academy student's life. The middle school curriculum offers fine arts and creative expressions, which is a drama class, every single year. Sixth graders are required to take concert band, choir, or orchestra. Of course, those opportunities continue into the upper school where our band, orchestra, plays, and choir wow audiences and win accolades for their performances. The fine arts offerings are more varied in the upper school where ceramics, photography, painting, and drawing are our most popular electives. The incredible artwork they create is exhibited regularly in the gallery. The fourth pillar is community service, which has grown in importance and vibrancy, particularly in the last 30 years. Academy actually has a service department. Like there's a math department and an English department, our service department works to ensure that the school's commitment to serve others runs throughout our curriculum beginning in the lower school and is coordinated through until graduation. It's worth mentioning that each year the Upper School Service Board is the largest club on campus. Diversity, equity, and inclusion is the fifth pillar. Academy was one of the first schools to hire a full-time Director of Diversity, and our commitment to working to be an inclusive community is strong. A quarter of Academy students receive tuition assistance. Our families come from all over Central Ohio, from all sorts of backgrounds. Indeed, 40% of our students identify as students of color. Academy truly strives to be a rich community of diverse learners. Finally, the last pillar is our commitment to building ethical students of strong character. For over a hundred years, Academy has been instilling our foundational five plus two values in our students. Those values are respect, responsibility, honesty, compassion, fairness, moral courage, and integrity. We believe that without a foundation of ethical behavior, even the greatest accomplishments are hollow. Finally, I think it's important to mention what Academy is not. If people know about our school, they assume that since it's filled with high achievers, it must be a pressure cooker school filled with stressed out, hyper-competitive, unfriendly children who are exhausted. That's simply not the case. When you tour our facilities and see our students in action, you see happy, interested, and interesting youngsters. They enjoy their time here at Academy. It's truly a wonderfully warm and nurturing environment. We hope you'll come and take a closer look.